the, the, the viewpoint. See the beauty. If really I'm lying, you try to witness with me the landscape, the sounds of the bird. The animals are not far from this place here. When I'm talking that, if you really want to explore Uganda and you leave Kidepo aside of your bucket list, you're going to be missed a lot. Because what I'm experiencing here currently, it is breathtaking, beautiful. Breathtaking, beautiful. The place, a place like this, I can't stop comparing it. And it's a place which can take your soul and leave the brain to think something else. Nature, landscape, but wild animal down there. What else? Ismail Nozul, diesel engineer, join me as I share my passion for building four-wheel drive trucks and traveling to the remotest part of the world.
different as usual with Jaffo. They came in, but this time they've been peacefully. There was no problem at all. Sugar Kuna, Langit and Daiko.
It seems like our timing has always been perfect, always. Reaching a deep time around midday is always preferable to get our, our lunch break. And always Kidepo, part of Africa still, especially typical Kidepo Valley National Park is still continue to be surprising me. Day, new day new scene like this. And I can't stop compare the area, the places I'm keep this we are keeping discovering. And remember they are looking alike, but I want to tell you are not the same. See the landscape. Look at it. We've seen I think I'm gonna name it. The, the park of gorgeous, spectacular, fantastic, magnificent, name it, landscape. Because I can't still compare the, lands, the, the landscape I'm seeing currently and here presence in the, on top of the rock, the, the, the viewpoint. See the beauty. If really I'm lying, you try to witness with me the landscape, the sounds of the bird. The animals are not far from this place here. When I'm talking that, if you really want to explore Uganda and you leave Kidepo aside of your bucket list, you're gonna be missed a lot. Because what I'm experiencing here currently, it is breathtaking, beautiful. Breathtaking, beautiful. A place, a place like this, I can't stop comparing it 
and is a place which can take your soul and leave the brain to think something else. Nature, landscape, but wild animal down there. What else? We just saw the lion on top of the rock like this. Just next to that hill. Look at the beauty. I think the person who named Uganda to be the pearl, not of the East Africa, not of the West Africa, not of the North Africa, not not of the South Africa, but the pearl, the only, the sole pearl of Africa in the heart of, half, of Africa. You think the person was very clever and the person really, I think was even here with, with the place where I stood was here. And me, I'm just come to compliment him to give that name because that name deserve it. It really deserve the name of be called the Pearl of Africa. And we as the Overlander enthusiastic as well, I think we didn't want to lose that name. And in our project, we name it across the Pearl of Africa and part one Karamoja road trip. I think we have been meaning remember we never visit this place before but we read a lot of books and the more we are we getting we are getting in the bush the more the place it's becoming typical typical absolutely typical familiar and shows the writer of the book didn't lie. Reason why. Reading the books without come and pay. Have a visualize the place. Now I can understand. Whenever I'll be back from here, back home, I'll read the book and I hope it will be more enjoyable and more fascinating. Such such a remarkable coincidence remarkable absolutely coincidence to reach at the midday and i think this is gonna be where our lunch stop gonna be taking place and i think i leave us to four brothers to share their thoughts about what we are in top of the rock Welcome. thank you very much my teammate this is a Nagoso Kapire. It's a long word from Karamogon. Which maybe if you come here you can find details where they were calling. But look like this as he has already spoken, this look to be places where people could hunt after a long hunt of these wild animals, then they resort to do the roasting. That's why it's called the Nagoso Kopire, where you resort, you really yoga and you come and share whatever hunt you have got from these animals. So uh, since I talk about lunch, I think we are trying also to follow that little bit of that culture, but not that we are going to do with this animal as our meal. We have carry our own food. So we are really advising you, please come and enjoy this place the way we are enjoying. In fact, there's no way we now we can even term it, right? We feel really we have really reached a climax on earth. Maybe if there's anything better should be in heaven. So I just invite you to come and visit Kidepo National Park. Just get from us and use us in order to make you really enjoy this place. Thank you very much. Maybe my colleague. Are you drop your thoughts here? <laughs> Uh, it's a bit difficult. There are no words to describe, to describe what we are what we are experiencing here. 
the best words should be your presence. Sorry. That's all I have. We're going to pull pull down our gadgets and uh, take a good position and join the the, the 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 founders of this name. We have also reorganized ourselves. Sit down under the tree. We have our lunch. Eat and enjoy ourselves and continue. But as I said, no words. But the best is come up yourself. Silence. What a day. Cut. Where is the panga? <laughs> Thank you.
Uganda pale Uganda nilifurahi na tingi tingi we I am Nur Ismail Nozur, diesel engineer. Join me as I share my passion for building four-wheel drive trucks and traveling to the remotest part of the world.